Hello, this is Mr. Inadequate. The game is Baldur's Gate 3, and this is Orson, the level 1 warlock. He has the fiend, he's human, sage background. Uh, besides my magical capabilities, I have a crossbow. Now, that isn't why I'm here. This will probably not be an overlong video. It will come out tomorrow, July 3rd. And it is because of that that I'm making it. Because in one month, on August 3rd, Baldur's Gate 3 will launch and become a reality. And there are three new races. Half-Orc, Dragonborn, and I believe Dwergar. Now, I did some research into Dungeons and Dragons 5e rules. I don't, I know that this is based on that, and I don't know how much of it will actually be in. But from what I've been able to see, Dragonborn looked to make a very good paladin. Also, probably a, a Dragonborn, or a Dragonblood, rather, sorcerer would probably be very good. And, uh, etc. Now, Dwergar, surprisingly enough, the Grey Dwarfs look to be the, the new class. I don't know about the old class. I'll have to look through things. That would be best suited for a monk. Now, there'll probably be other ones that are just as suited or even more suited. But Dwergar could be fighters like dwarves, or they could be a monk. Now... What's it leave? Half orc, half orc, you know, probably paladin, probably a uh, fighter. I'm not sure what else. I'll have to look at the stats more closely. But at this point, if you would like me to uh, show off in the videos I make after launch of Baldur's Gate 3, one of the new races, and, you know, have an idea what I should use. Don't give me a stupid thing. There's some. Every race has something that it shouldn't be. I'm not going to do something stupid like a mage half orc. But if you have any feedback, let me know. Otherwise, I'll just do what I do. And uh, pretty sure I've already, yeah. So let's talk to. Uh, What's her name here? It's been a while since I played. We're just going to wake her. Mm. Now, You're alive. I'm, alive. I'm also told that there will be multi class And that means I might very well make a half elf half elf wood elf ranger and multi-class a little bit of rogue into it make it a really good thief i don't know i'll have to play around i remember the ship i remember falling then the horse i'm probably not going to do a uh Complete walkthrough through the game. It's supposed to be between 100 and 200 hours. And uh, if you do everything, and maybe a minimum of 75 hours if you just do the main quest. And no, I'm not going to. I'll show you different things. But, you know, and I'm also playing Eve, and I'll show you different things of that. But, you know... I'm just making this because when this video comes out, it will be one month to launch on August 3rd. First things first, we need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our head. Yes. We need each other, and we both know what's at stake. 
Now, Shadow Heart's always going to be in my company. As long as I can keep her happy. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. Lead the way. Yeah, yeah. So let's just play this a little bit. Nothing new here. Yeah, who, who knows what the beginning will be like. Now, I do want to make sure I get as much of the camping stuff as I can. Wish I had a bag of holding. Put up a fight by the looks of it. Not that it mattered in the end. Mm. Wouldn't wish that fate on anyone. Fresh water. There must be a settlement somewhere nearby. I'll take that. Give that to a Starian when we get them. I'll take the rope. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we're not going to try the door. Got a roll of 20. And I don't have a rope with me right now. Or even a ranger. We'll do the first combat. Wow. Uh-oh. This could be, uh... Okay. Gotta keep fighting.
Okay. <laughs> so that was the first combat. Now we are, yes, of course, I don't think we need short rest. No, we don't. Well, we might for spells. Anyway. Now. We'll take this one, yes, now. Yeah, Hex is good. And we'll accept that. Now we'll do Shadow Heart. Now. Turn on dead will work. Customize our spells. I like to add the extra healing. Now, do I want bless or shield? Bless, yeah. That, go, that goes up to three. So we'll do that. Accept it. Now, I don't think these guys have anything. No. We took care of them fairly coolly. The rolls were on our side. Now, uh, anyhow, as I was saying, I'll be starting over. I don't know exactly what I'll play, but we'll see. And, uh, if you want to give me input on it, that would be nice, too. Thank you very much to the new subscribers. You know, I've cut back on uh, recording, and more people are watching, so I I can only guess that maybe I was over-recording. Whichever. Oh, do the short rest. Yeah, okay. <coughs> And uh, this will come out on July 3rd, basically a short video. Uh, you know, I can't wait, really, for Baldur's Gate 3 to launch. The closer it gets, the more excited I get. Uh, heads up, I don't know how many videos I'll do this month. Expect a kind of long one to come out on July 17th, which... Will mark 30 years of me uh, being abstinent from drugs and alcohol. It's a big mark for me because I spent 22 years abusing the shit out of them. So 30 years not doing that is a big thing. And I will probably talk about a bunch of stuff and uh, have a video. Last year I did uh, Farming Simulator 22. I may very well set that back up and do that takes a little bit because i've got a steering wheel i gotta hook up to my desk and everything but it's easy to talk while i'm farming so anyhow that's it this is mr inadequate basically uh a heads up on the august 3rd launch of Baldur's gate 3 and what i might be looking at doing and if you want to give feedback it's always accepted this is Mr. Inadequate signing out.